Welcome back. First at 10 tonight, San Benito County officials are trying to address the issue of homelessness along the San Benito County River. The riverbed now filled with encampments and they've decided to temporarily move people at a site near the San Benito County Jail. KIO and Stephanie Aceves was in Hollister with more on this emergency ordinance to clean up that area and relocate people. Stephanie. I spoke with one county supervisor who says he felt it was time to address the issue of homelessness at the San Benito County River because it poses serious public health and safety issues. San Benito County supervisors came together on Tuesday to discuss what exactly to do with the homeless in San Benito County. Colin Kazmicki, the supervisor for District 2, says a fire in April along the river bed became an eye-opening moment for the need to address the issue. Encampments are really just out of control, to be frank. It's not just a few tents here and there. I mean, there are vehicles, there's a whole uh, a slew of garbage down there. It's, it's really coming getting to a point where it's out of control. It's taken about two months, yet there are now plans on temporarily moving individuals into a temp facility near the San Benito County Jail near Flynn Road. And so having them near the jail site is, is a good spot because it's near services, behavioral health services, health and human services, um, you know, social workers and, and the homeless shelter services are right in that same area. Um, and it's still close enough to town where it's, it's you know, I think the, the best option we have. Over the years, the problem has worsened at the riverbed with the slew of fires and other potential health and safety risk. However, the mayor of Hollister doesn't agree with the idea of a tent facility. Yeah. We have proven here that it, our shelter works. And if we have an issue with needing more space, I've recommended to the county that we use the conference room that they have in the facility for additional beds until we get a larger facility built, which I think is better because the services are there. If you create a tent city but don't have services, it's going to create failure and a lot of problems for us. According to the latest homeless census completed in 2019, around 282 individuals are experiencing home insecurity in San Benito County. Because Mickey says due to the limits with the lease, there cannot be an expansion at the only homeless shelter with a total of 50 beds in San Benito County. He emphasizes that the temp facility near the county jail is only temporary with more long term solutions in the works. The tent facility that we're putting up is a short term temporary solution. It's meant to allow to give us some flexibility so that we have a little bit of time to um, really plan aggressively for medium and long term solutions, such as additional shelter space, um, tiny, a tiny home village that we're considering and, and, and a good amount of transitional housing. The county is also looking at creating an anti camping ordinance in Hollister. Stephanie Aceves, KION News Channel 546.